And plenty of scouts and GMs still in attendance for the second half. And, you know, never too late for these young prospects to make a great first impression. What's going yeah, on, everybody? Still time to show them something, open some eyes, and, you know, that's what the, uh, they're here to do. NBA you know, one of the things I noticed this year on my NBA way into the big event here is all the glitz um, and the glamour. I mean, the arena's too decked bad. out, you've got vendors outside, um, the limousines with all the celebrities games, coming to attend. Uh, tell you what, I, I'm um, just glad I'm wearing my best outfit because <laughs> otherwise I wouldn't have fit in very well. Yeah, you look sharp, that buddy. You are help. as sharp I'm as they center. come. Um, as we were talking earlier on, the paparazzi and all those other folks making their way out. And because they're here, this has become one of their key events of the year here in New York. And that's saying a lot considering all that goes on in the big out. On the sheen. He's in at center. Porter is out there with Zeller. Then there's Burke. And it's Oladipo in at the two spot. That's the group in the game right now for the elites. Carter Williams, the pass to Muhammad. This is to Carter Williams. Shot clock at six. Here's Ellis. No problem on the jumper in close. Ellis has got nine. And for those of you turning in, we're about a minute into the second half. Burke kicks to Oladipo. Down low, here's the machine. Ellis with some nice D. In a game that can affect your draft stock, bad timing to struggle like this. Yeah, he is not helping himself, that's for sure. Carter Williams with the bucket. You know, there's no better sign of how efficiently a team is operating than their assist number. And theirs are fantastic. It's just beautiful basketball to watch, Clark. Now, here's Burke. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Oh, and it looks like that's going to be a goaltending call. Yep, that's it. So they'll get the basket. He almost got to that shot in time, but not quite. You can't touch the ball once it's on the way down. The Stars trail by 14. And Muhammad kicks to Carter Williams. Carter Williams off the pick from Bennett. And again, it will drop another make there from Carter Williams. Carter Williams has got four this quarter. The second he got around the pick and shook his man, it was straight to the bucket for the easy dude. Very, very well done. Now the pass to the machine. Feeds to Burke. Pass to Porter. Four on the clock. Second shot opportunity. Rejected by Bennett. The offense continues to struggle. Just one make in their five attempts. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. And the offense just getting right to the rim, but at least they saved the layup with the foul. That's old school basketball rules. I mean, at the end of the day, no easy layup. Earn it from the line. Both free throws good for McLemore. Well, you can count on him, can't you? He seems to knock down free throws consistently all game long. Burke kicks to Oladipo. Second half of play with just under two and a half minutes gone. Now Burke, he's had some playing time, but no scoring yet from him. The step back jumper is good. And the elites lead by 12. Another open jump shot there. Their defense not putting up much of a fight. Let's catch up with Doris from the sideline. Hey, Kevin, during that last break, I heard the elites coach as he addressed his team. He's looking for some old-fashioned offense right now. He wants the pick and roll to be the centerpiece of their game plan at that end of the floor. He told them also they should be swarming to the basket at the offensive end. He wants a lot of bodies inside. Probably a good time to make some changes with a good chunk of the second half still to go, Kevin. All right, Doris. The feed to Porter. And Ellis with the block. And it's the machine with the foul. And that'll be his third foul so far. The Stars trail by 12. And Muhammad kicks to Carter Williams. Muhammad sets a pick for Carter Williams. He feeds it to Muhammad. Pass to Ellis. Six on the shot clock. Unloads from 13. Finally a miss, but still four for five shooting to start this third quarter. Well, it's the edge they've had in that area on the glass that's played a big role in this game. 
Yeah, they've got some strong guys, Steve. Guys that are strong and well put together, and they've used that strength to their advantage down low. And that's going to be out of bounds. They'll keep possession. Maybe a low percentage pass, but it, it still nearly got through. I like it, though. I mean, it's an aggressive play. Heads up defending to deflect it away. Now here's Carter Williams. He's got six. Carter Williams off the pick from Ellis. Five to shoot. Here's Muhammad. And misses it off the right side of the rim. That's a tough one there because he's wide open. That's a shot he expects to make. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. Well, he earned that one. Took the hit and still found a way to knock it down. Yeah, fantastic body control. And the will to get it done. You like that focus. Noel's checked in for the elites. Now here's Muhammad. Shoots it up. Shot is off. Some solid defense here from Noel. Oh! Now here's Oladipo. He's covered by McLemore. Oladipo, good. And we touched on his draft stock earlier. It might be going up the way he's playing today. Yeah, I would agree with that. I mean, he's been something, hasn't he? Really competing well out there. Here's Carter Williams. He kicks to Ellis. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. Ellis has got 11 points. A terrific display of passing ability out there. I mean, he's doing a fantastic job. And that's what we expected to see with his court vision. I mean, he makes things happen offensively. Now, here's Oladipo. He's got 13. Porter passes to the machine. The dish now to Oladipo. Here's Burke. Dives for it. Out of bounds. The Stars will take possession. And a new group getting ready now for the Stars. The Elites leading by 17. Larkin kicks to Porter. Pass to Caldwell Pope. There's a screen. Buries the long-range jumper. Caldwell Pope's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Now the Stars with it. McCollum kicks to Walters. He dishes it to McCollum. Here's the three. Porter pulls it in. Porter's got five rebounds tonight. Boy, he's really been active on the glass. And a nice bonus from him. I mean, if he can rebound like this in the NBA, he'll make a team very happy. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Good! Caldwell Pope's got five points so far. Here comes McCollum. Quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. With one on the clock, he got it up in time, but it wouldn't fall for him. And as we can... me back to one of the hottest tickets of the entire year the rookie showcase presented by champs such a great opportunity for these young players to test their skills against their peers you got that right i mean who doesn't want to play against the best well that's why you play in the game like this because you know these players want to compete against the best in the world that's why they're all trying to get to the nba fourth quarter on the court for the stars carter williams is out there with mclemore and there's Bennett, then it's Ellis, and it's Muhammad in at the three. Now here's Carter Williams. Kicks to Muhammad. Ellis, left side. And he drops in the layup off the glass. And their solid play in the paint continues, guys. Well, that's been the focus, Clark, as we've watched. I mean, they've created one chance after another inside. Burke dishes to Oladipo. Here's Porter, and he gets the shot to fall after coming off the pick. Good vision he's showing. When the defense collapses, he's making the right decision. Well, that awareness and understanding, that's something scouts and GMs love to see. Now here's McLemore. Oh, 
Dishes to Carter Williams. Six to shoot. Now, here's Bennett. D right on him. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. Some changes for the elites. Olenek comes in for the machine. And Franklin subbed in. The elites leading by 23. Zeller passes to Burke. Feeds to Porter. He kicks it to Burke. The pass to Porter. Here's Oladipo. Sinks the three-pointer. Oladipo's got a couple of three-pointers now in the fourth for the elites. The three-pointer has been his best weapon here today, no question. The D has been all mixed up, confused, bamboozled, allowing him way too much space. Bennett kicks to Carter Williams. Second chance shot, and there's the layup. Out the bucket from Bennett. They have got to put a body on him, because otherwise, with his agility and athleticism, they're not going to be able to contain him on the offensive glass. Burke, the pass to the machine. There's the feed to Porter. Passes it to Oladipo. There's the dish to Burke. Zeller. Terrific design on the pick foot, and he lays it in. Zeller's got four points now in the quarter. He's played an important role in their offense today, guys. Without him, they may not be in the lead. Pass to Muhammad. Carter Williams kicks to Bennett. And the layup's good off the glass. I like the way he's not forcing anything, taking advantage of what the defense has given him. He's been a key contributor for them in this quarter. Pass to Porter. And it's blocked by Carter Williams. Shot denied. And Steve, I like what we're seeing from him defensively. Yeah, me too, Clark. I mean, he's really taking on the challenge, and that's smart. I mean, scouts are looking at that as, as much, if not more, than what you do offensively. Ellis is checked in for McLemore. Now here's Carter Williams, fended by Burke. And here is Carter Williams, just five on the clock. And it's good. 15 points for Ellis. He's been a different guy in the second half, guys. His shooting percentage far better than it was before the break. Burke kicks to Porter. There's a good screen. Great use of the pick to create room for the jumper. He had a whole lot of space to get that shot off. Yeah, I don't think the defender did a good job there of getting over the top of the screen. Carter Williams kicks to Bennett. Here's Carter Williams. Ellis left side. Porter pulls it in. An eight rebound advantage like the one they have now is always going to swing the score hard in that team's direction. And that's certainly been the case today. Their rebounding has made a huge difference. And Oladipo kicks to Burke. He feeds it to Zeller. The rebound by Carter Williams. And here's the Stars. Bennett dishes to Muhammad. Ellis, the pass to Carter Williams. 131 left in the fourth quarter. Tries to keep it alive. Muhammad, no luck. Muhammad's gone only one of five shooting from the floor. Burke kicks to Oladipo. Ellis on the double team. Now, here's Oladipo. And there's the pass to the machine. And a foul on the shot. He'll go to the strike for two. And a chance for just a second now to check out the scoring breakdown for the elites. You know, one of the big stories has been the three ball. It's been a key part of their offense throughout the game. And they're getting the ball inside, which is what I like. High percentage shots down on the block and in the paint area. Here's McCollum. He dishes it to Goodwin. 56 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Walters passes to Ellis. 
been a nice game for Ellis. 15 points and one rejection in this game, too. And it was a good one, too. Really one of the highlights, I thought, of the game defensively. And Ellis drops them both. Guys, we have seen them with a lot of good ball movement. Well, you like the smooth operating they're showing you here. I mean, things are clicking, and more importantly, it makes them tough to defend. Yeah, there's no agenda. I mean, the ball's just moving to whoever is open, and as a result, they've kind of developed a clicking uh, kind of pace to their game. It's been fun to watch. Passes it to Franklin. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. And Ellis with the block. But he gets it back. Olenek the pass to the machine. Kicks it to Olenek. Pass to Franklin. Here's the machine. He's guarded by Ellis. Franklin kicks to Larkin. Six to shoot. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Fader on the way. And he gets the bucket. So it's the Elites winning this one easily. Well, it was a fun one, but the Elites just had the better day. And they'll have a little bit of bragging rights here over the Stars as the draft nears closer. And although this isn't a league game, you could tell each player out there wanted to win. I mean, no question about it, this was a competitive affair. And there was no shortage of action on either side of the ball. Thanks for joining us for this broadcast of the NBA Rookie Showcase. I'm Kevin Hart for Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr. We'll see you next time. There we go, everybody. Thanks very much for watching. Um, that was the first and second half, if you watch both videos, of the uh, the Rookie Showcase. And the first episode, I guess, or first two episodes in our uh, NBA 2K14 career mode. Um, hey, man. We'll catch you again for the third episode. Just want to let you know that was a good game.